hello everyone so today we are going to update our shoot like me project into unreal engine 5.1 we were using unreal engine 5.03 until now and now i have updated to 5.1 so and we are going to update the project and see if we get any bugs and issues that need fixing and fix it so yeah that's what we are going to do in this episode all right so this is the unreal engine 5 project here i'm going to select uh, the pro u project and the source and config and content folders and create another folder should like me ue 5.1 and let's paste it okay copy and complete now here i'll change the engine version instead of 5.0 to 5.1 okay now i get this generating project files window because i have some c++ code here so if there are no issues in the c++ code i should be able to open the project file without going into manually build the source but let's see let's first let the project file build process complete okay let's try opening the project mm. all right i got this message the following modules are missing or built with a different engine version should like me would you like to rebuild them now yes okay first things should be building in the background because i don't see any window yet or the unreal engine logo that we see the splash screen when the project opens right i got the unreal engine logo but it's in my other screen and i can't drag it into this screen but it looks like project is opening so no c plus plus errors all right project did open and preparing shaders let's test this out okay let's see go for the screen press alt p it seems things are working Wait, let me reduce the audio a bit All right. Oh, not a good place to get spawned. Oh. I am in a spawning location. That explosion looks a bit weird. I don't remember if everything went shot upward in the previous oh I killed myself okay let me detach from the character and observe others behavior They keep fighting so basically the fight system seems to work nice and the performance also seems good considering the number of characters and the number of AIs running simultaneously Okay, uh, 
Oh, we got. Uh, I think I got this error only because I detached from the character player. Let's go to a more quiet map and test out the player's functions. This is the player character. Let me move it to a place where I can access these weapons. Why did this automatically export? Is there two of them on top? Something is wrong with those barrels. Yeah, see? They are not supposed to get activated until I shoot them. So I'm not sure what's wrong with that. Need to check that. And the next part. Oh, why is not dying? Why the character is not dying with this sniper? flamethrower okay I guess in the first time the shade is required oh that's a bug it's already dead it's not supposed to scream Dead dudes should not scream. Okay, I should note this down. Mm. Frame through ammo. Check the RPG too. Right. That one is still going. working so here this GC object this is the geometric cache which I used to implement explosion 
uh, debris so this is the basically the destructive by mesh and I have actually set it to I have disabled this it's not visible so I don't know why it becomes visible inside the game it should only get visible when the mesh is destructed and that happens here in this explored event so last time i tried to stop physics simulation in the beginning and enable it in the middle when i want to explode it i think it didn't work for some reason so now let's try that again by default i leave the physics simulation stop and when we want to destruct it set simulate physics let's enable it and see by the way do we see that weird double barrel effect no okay ah. right it's working nice so the problem with the sniper rifle not doing any damage was actually this i just looked into that and i have forgot to pin the shooter so this means whoever the character who's doing the shooting so we need to give a reference to the character who is holding the gun otherwise it will not work now it is working see nice so yeah that fixed barrel issue is fixed sniper issue is fixed did we notice anything in our playthrough anything else i think that a sniper issue was also uh, should also be there in 5.0 version as well i need to go back and check i don't remember when did i miss that okay so i think that's it one more thing let's check this yeah that is also working now great so thanks for watching as always updated project files will be available for the download in patreon page link would be in the description below and also i didn't forget i had to test the helicopter part as well but i will look in, do that and if there are any bugs i will fix that in the next video so thanks for watching see you in another episode goodbye